Yo, what's good? Let's check out the new episode for Vivi. Logo reveal. If you want to talk about anime and manga, here's my socials, links in the description below, and the YouTuber things, like the video, comment, and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. In that last episode of Vivi, we saw it end on a pretty sad note. Um, a character that Vivi had an emotional attachment to. I mean, she is an AI, but she does sort of have these emotions. She does have attachment to characters. And we saw this character die. Uh, she was on a plane that went down. Like, like it was a malfunction. Yeah, it's, she died. And I can tell you right now, that's some ReZero shit. The author of ReZero, he was like, <laughs> you know what we're gonna do? Let's write this in there. A little bit of death, a little bit of sadness. Let's add this in there. I'm hoping we don't get a ton of this, but a little bit of it, you know, like a little bit more, maybe like two more friends that die eventually. Eh, I'd be okay with that. If you didn't see my reaction to the first two episodes of Vivi, I got your back. You can check this link right up here. Also in the description below, go check out that video. Now let's go check out this episode. Satellite. I got sneeze already. Hey. All right, we're good. I just blew that shit everywhere. Who cares? Some AI. Taking over a satellite? Okay. What the F? Oh, this is that giant tower, right? The giant giant tower? They put a tablet on it? It's like a virtual tower? It's connected to everything? What is going on here? Vivi score? Okay, are we gonna get a little bit of music finally from her? Oh, hey, uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. Ooh, is the OP her just singing? That'd be great. This is gonna be a really chill OP. I was looking for some hype, dude. Ah, oh, man, no hype feels bad. I like the fact that the, oh, cool. Even AIs watch it. I like the fact that the OP is, is her singing. That's pretty interesting, right? I wonder if all of them are gonna be like that. Is it always gonna be her singing? Maybe it's a different song every time or just the same song? Like, that's pretty cool. The hell? No, 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 it's, it's more than that, bro. Yeah, your heart. Yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. I see. He, he's already. You got this. I'll let you speak, doctor. Hold on. Would he be a doctor or like an engineer? What? How can I'm under? I'm kind of confused how the AI can feel itchy. Also, what does a shower do for him? Naked. So it's been 15 years. One thing I want to know is what the different light flashes mean. Like the light blue, the, the red, orange, whatever. Like, what do they mean? Oh, it's because she said that one nice thing to the guy. The one little motivational message. That shit really struck a chord with him. Okay. Okay. Mmm. 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 Damn. What? Dude, that is massive. That's the space station that 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 we saw crash early or like, you know, go into the atmosphere earlier. Wow. Bro, I'm trying to live in a future where I can just live in space, bro. That's sick. I'm trying to live in space. Oh, wow. How the fuck did she get up here, bro? They skipped over that whole part. I mean, I guess she like traveled to a space station and fucking got flown out but like what about documentation was it all done by the little bear hmm oh and she's going by vivi right now too interesting that's a weird looking smile dude hmm oh Wait, that lady, Estella? So she's the one that crashed that shit into Earth? Damn. Well, damn. 
Little Vivi song now. Oh, wow. Hmm. So what are you going to do, Vivi? What are you going to do? Hmm. She's thinking that there's something beyond it. Direct box. Dang, get wrecked, Vivi. I don't know, man. She don't say, hey, I don't know. She said we're all big family, but she, that didn't look like a happy face. Dude, did her clothes dry that fast, bro? She just put them in. Get involved with what girl? <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yo, I think if she wore a little beret, that shit would complete the outfit. The fit would be completed. Beep boop 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 beep boop boop boop. So that's the dude that used to run it. <sighs> Bro, you better put the fr you turn that shit around. You can't. Oh my god, bro. The frame was facing. Tw oh my god, bro. Right? Am I wrong about this? It wasn't a face facing to the person that would be sitting in the chair, not away from them, toward whoever walked in the door. It's facing away from the door, not toward the door. Oh my gosh, bro. She gonna get got. And there she is. Oh my god, dude. Oh, he doesn't stop talking. Shut the fuck up, you bear. How am I supposed to catch any of this, bro? I think he's supposed to be caught. I think one thing that, like... So this probably works really well for like the Japanese audience, but for an American audience or like a Western audience, the comic relief doesn't really hit like that because there's too much of it. Like I cannot read all this. Can you tell me about this photo? That's Vivi speaking. And the bear says, uh, you tune me out way too much. Just so much. I don't know, man. I don't think it was her. I think that there's something beyond this. It's not Estella that, that fucked everything up. What the fuck is that? Hmm. Hmm, interesting. Bringing that back up again. Hmm. She sympathizes with her, I guess. Damn, was that the fucking thunder? Yep, that's thunder. Whoa, that's awesome. What the fudge? Dude, that's sick. Mm. Maybe it's somebody else. Why'd you turn, bro? You're Vivi. Oh my god, what a mistake. Oh, wow. She's the younger sister of the girl who died on the plane. Holy shit. Oh, it was the pink. Who's that? Wait, what's going on? You need a hug. Oh, never mind. This bitch is crazy. This bitch is crazy. <gasps> Bro, she is crazy, Estella. Just ripped off the chick's head. I was thinking it was the pink hair girl that, that might have like somehow gotten into Stella's head and made her crash. Dude, not anymore. Not anymore, dude. She can't even get into her own head anymore. <laughs> okay, so what happened in this episode, man? The OP was Vivi singing. Pretty cool. I like that. Uh, she checked on the programs 15 years later, pretty much from the death of uh, that fan, that, that girl that was her fan, 15 years later. And what happens now? Hey, we gotta go to space. That's what the bear says. We gotta go to space. We gotta stop a satellite from being crashed. This Estella's gonna uh, crash a, sta a, a satellite. So that's that's we're we're, we're gonna stop that. That's kind of crazy. Didn't really expect something like that. But hey, man, I guess you gotta do what you gotta do. So that's the new goal: stopping the satellite from being crashed. There's like this mystery about Estella. Maybe she killed the former owner of the satellite. 
the satellite hotel or whatever. I don't know, Sunset Satellite Hotel. I, that's what I guess I'll call it. It's the, the Sunset Satellite Hotel. But no, he he died naturally. It wasn't, or not naturally, but it was like a like an actual accident. It wasn't like some accident caused by an AI or something. It was like a legit accident. Unless at the end it's saying that the pink haired girl did it. Like, not exactly sure what was going on there. But I guess the pink haired girl and Estella, they both had this plan to crash the satellite. That's at least how they're making it seem. Like Estella's like, and now the owner, like maybe the owner had a dream of crashing the fucking satellite into earth. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't know exactly what I want to say happened. I don't know exactly what happened, but I mean, that's my guess, I guess. Cause yeah, then Estella kills the pink haired AI. So she, yeah, she big dead, bro. Vivi is, is, has been snooping and I think she's the reason why they're accelerating the plan to now instead of waiting the 23 hours. It's all because Vivi has been snooping around, but Vivi's got to stop them, right? You know, that's the plan. Vivi, Matsumoto, they got to stop the satellite from being crashed into earth because that's like a bunch of people dying and like that's a pretty serious event so how are they going to get it done i'm not entirely sure but this was pretty interesting dude i like the one type of animation that they do yeah 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 like this like like this thing here hold on like this scene i don't know near the end they draw it differently it doesn't it doesn't have that same like it has this weird like glow to it like even on the skin and, it, and it's almost like doll like um, I've seen them do that for Vivi as well. It is very different. I like when they do that with the eyes too. They make it look like an actual lens. Um, that looks pretty sick. I, I love it when they do that. Yeah, so Estella, turns out she is crazy. Man, for a second I was like, oh man, maybe Estella's like pretty high. She's not that great. Nope, this bitch is crazy. She just murdered, um, the, the pink haired girl, AI, whatever. So Estella is indeed crazy. I don't know how to feel about it. But, um, yeah, she, she's got to go down, man. She cannot be out here murdering all these innocent folk. You know what I'm saying? I'm interested to see where the story goes with Vivi. Like, how does she stop Estella? How does she know that it's actually Estella? You know, even though, yes, Masumoto says, like, yeah, but the events between the death of the owner and the events of the satellite being crashed, those are two separate things. So she might have not killed the owner, but don't mean she ain't going to crash the satellite. So yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm interested in seeing how this plays out. I still enjoy this series. Uh, this is three episodes now. So early, early rating of the series. I'll probably give it an eight after three episodes. Then I decide what I give it on a scale of one to 10. But I continue to watch the series as long as it's not absolute garbage. Like even if it's like a six out of 10, I probably still watch it just because there could be more to it. You know, if I really don't like a series, then I'll drop it. Like I'm probably going to drop Koi Kimo. I don't like it. I, I'm, I'm giving it like a five. I don't like it. I'm going to drop it. Move on. It's just not my vibe. You know, it's just not my vibe. So I'm dropping that, but I'm going to keep up with everything else. You know, even Joron, who I'm not, I'm not doing reactions for it, but I enjoy it at least. And so early rating for this, I give it a solid eight. And by the end of the series could go up could go down from here i want to know what you guys have thought of these first three episodes it's kind of weird that they just like went into space just phew, to, hey we're going into space like episode three episode two is like we gotta stop this law from being passed episode three we gotta stop a, a space satellite hotel from crashing into the earth like damn bro y'all really just turned up you guys went from zero to at least like 60 in, in like real quick so from here let me know what you guys thought of this episode and as always if you enjoyed the video then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one i do anime episode reactions manga chapter reviews and reviews on anime and manga once i catch up to or finish a series so if that sounds like the type of content that you might be interested in then please do subscribe to the channel and until next time make sure you all keep it fresh peace